Pete Kyle with Debbie Abayo here today and uh, we're going to talk to you and show you how to hobble your horse. There's several reasons that we hobble our horses. One of them is to teach young horses patience when they're tied up that they don't just paw and paw and paw that they learn to stand there flat footed and that's really good for them and also it does teach them a lot of patience to uh, be able to come out into an open area and be hobbled and they learn to stand still. So if something happens that you've got to get off your horse and leave him in an area, hopefully he'll, be no he'll know to stand still and not run off. Uh, this is one of my favorite hobbles right here. Uh, it's just a real double uh, thick piece of leather. So it's very sturdy. It's uh, one piece with a ring. And we'll just take it and put it around one foot. And then, and then able to come back and, and uh, fasten it on the other side right here. And then you've got their feet right there hobbled and it's a real simple and real safe way of doing it. The leather is very soft, okay, and pliable so it, it won't hurt your horse at any time. If he struggles a little bit with his feet, uh, it won't hurt him at all. And he'll struggle and then he'll, he'll learn just to stand there. Uh, First time I ever hobble one, I always have someone hold their head uh, because uh, it, you want to make sure that when you're down on the ground, anytime you're on the ground on a horse, that uh, you always have your safety and the, his safety uh, thought of. And so you want to make sure that you have someone that can help you uh, with your horse there. So I always start here on this left side. Let's go apply the hobble there. And you want to get it tied around the foot. If it's loose, like this, he'll be able to step out of it. So you pull it tight, and then you want to pick this foot up and bring it in close. And then, and then come through and get it tight as well. So now it's tight around both front feet, and this is where you need to be cautious yourself because they'll feel that the first time that you do it. They'll feel it and they'll pull. And this is when you get it done, you want to just step right away and let him stand there and find that himself. So, and, and that's a, a real safe way of hobbling one. Like I say, it's, it's real easy on them. And then uh, it's real safe and it's real simple to do rather than try and tie a bunch of knots with ropes and stuff like that. So that's my favorite way to do it. And this will teach a horse a lot of good things. And the one main thing is just learn to stand and be quiet. 